Okay, so guys, I prayed over my hair. That's how I got this one that I have right now. And I prayed and I said, God, let me know what you want me to do with my hair. So what I did is basically I would say 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 15 every day. But if a woman has long hair, it is a glory to her. It has been given to her as a covering. And I said that over my head, but I would put my name in there. And I did the same thing with my daughters. So then after that, um, after praying and fasting for a long time, I actually said, Holy Spirit, what would you have me to do um, for my hair regimen? He sent me an oil that he wanted me to use. It was called um, Miracle Drops or something um, by Shanshika. Um um, and she blessed me with um, two orders. I only ordered one a day and night, but she also blessed me with another one. And while having my hair braided, I did that every day and night drops. And then I would continue. I would spray my hair with the PHB three um, moist the spray, the um, leave-in conditioner. That's what I would do. And then um, once a week, I wash my hair with the PHB three uh, shampoo and the mask. After I rinsed that out, um, then I sprayed it, or continued it up with, I followed it up with uh, the leave-in conditioner spray. Then I did my day drops, night drops at night, and then I would wrap my hair up. And I would continue doing that for the whole weeks that I had my hair. I got my hair braided on the 14th, and um, <clears throat> and then um, I plan on taking it out uh, somewhere near the 28th. And I just wanted to show you how much hair growth I had just by doing the routine that God had given me because I wanted to see this for myself hold up do you see that do you see how long that is it hurts for me to do that but that's how much hair growth I got that is very long <laughs> normally you see something like this But my whole head has like long, 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 long ones. Like. And um, so we, it was Pentecostal Sunday and my daughter was asleep, my oldest daughter. And she woke up. She said it was like something hit her in her stomach. And I was in the hallway and she said, Mommy. And she was still asleep. She was like this. And she's like, Mommy, your hair is going to be as long as the hair that you have on your head right now. But it's going to be your hair. It's going to look like me, but it's yours. And when you take your hair out on the 28th, and she went back to sleep. And I asked her today, I said, Sierra, um, the other day, uh, when the Holy Spirit was in the house, and I, um, it was Pentecost Sunday, I said, it was Sunday. Do you remember telling Mommy anything? And she was like, hmm? I said, do you remember talking to me <clears throat> in your sleep? <clears throat> Excuse me. And she said, I don't think I have anything to drink. I just have my protein drink. Um, she said, Yeah, I remember something hitting me. Just hitting me. And I woke up and I said what I said. You know what I said. And then she said, um, And then she said, I went right back to sleep. And it was the weirdest thing because something hit me. In my stomach. And I said, Okay. Thank you, baby. And that was my confirmation that God had already manifested the hair that I had been praying for. I had prayed for curly hair down to my tailbone. And when it's pressed out, that is to my back of my thighs. And God's already manifested that. And you know that I had to keep on crucifying my flesh to say, if God said it, then God can't lie. God cannot lie to me. God cannot lie. And if he spoke through... Um, the prophet saying everything that you've been praying for. Of course, that's not the only thing I was praying for. My husband needs a heart transplant. Uh, I was just saying one example to let you guys know about the hair. He has a total artificial heart and we're waiting on a heart. His, we were praying on his antibodies as well to be good for him to get a heart. So, no, that was not the only prayer. But I'm just, this video is about the hair. So that's why I'm doing this video. And so he said everything, she said everything that uh, you've been praying for, it's already here. It's already manifested. It's no more waiting. It's here. And so my daughter, she did the confirmation that when she was asleep and she woke up out of her sleep and said, you know, mommy, when I'm knocked out, I'm knocked out. So I knew and she's like, it was so weird. So 
I knew I said, all right, Holy Spirit. That's why I'm standing in belief when I take these out. That's what Holy Spirit said. It is what it is. It's already manifested. Excuse me. And I am. It's already manifested. It's already here. Those protein shakes are just not <laughs> easy on the stomach. I've been burping the whole time. But anywho, but yes, until I show you guys the reveal, until next time, signing off, Carmel Vance. Bye.